Today we're here to upgrade my nanny's car. Sounds like a Lambo. This thing sounds like a sports car. I like. <laughs> Manny, how are you? Very good. How you doing, buddy? Very well. Good to see you. Oh, I was hoping to come pick up my Valkyrie yeah. spider, but good to see you. You, I, uh, you as well. Yeah. You, you know, Joey. See you. Yes, long time no see. Yes, sir. What is it? It's been a year since we came yeah, here last Yeah, time. yeah, yeah. Drove the DBS last yeah, time. See? That's time I brought the right hat. No, you That's brought the wrong hat. We're going to give you the new hat. <laughs> what, what? you new What's hat? your preference, black or green? Uh, I would go with black. Okay. What? Well, it's... Aston Martin? <laughs> when is my Valkyrie Spider coming? Yeah. I know, I'm so Did excited you hear about the new product. Vantage? Yes. V12? V12, yeah. Yeah, what do you think about that? Um, I don't know. I haven't, you don't have one here right now. No, <laughs> no. When is it coming? I got the email for a preview. Yeah, yeah. you want it? It's uh, your... So it, 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 it's public debut comes in March and should be delivered in Q4 2022. Yeah. Um, so it is limited to 300 units for the world. Last of the V12 images ever, um, and so carbon wide body, crazy wow. arrow, yeah. So it should be pretty impressive. What's the horse? Six thirty, I believe. Wow. Yeah, I just got released this morning. I can pull up all the details for you. Yeah, I'd yeah. love to take a look at it. Yeah, you should. We should set up an appointment yeah. for you and yeah. see. You know, they'll I do something for you in Gaden, and yeah. yeah. And in fact, when you go, oh, are you going over there soon? No, not. Maybe like late uh, June, July next. Year. Okay. Yeah. Um, so before then, we can set up a Zoom call for you so you yeah. can hear about it from them. Yeah. Which would be oh, great. Love to. Yeah. Love okay. To. Well, Joey, can yeah. Yeah. set up. Yeah. Well, thank you. There you go. I'll take this so you don't have to. You don't need a tag hanging around there. Well, today we're here to upgrade my nanny's car. You know, she has a Mercedes, <laughs> pink Mercedes. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, it's really personal. My daughter, she loves pink. And when he said there is a pink one here, I'm like, all right, let's yep. go. We may be upgrading my yeah. nanny's car yep. today. It's a different tone of pink, but. I think she'll like it. That's great. Sounds good. <laughs> Here's uh, my insurance. Awesome. Here's my driver license. Appreciate that. Give me two minutes while I'm Yeah, so Show they said um, they're going to start the kind of spec sessions on the Valkyrie Spider end of this year. Yeah, I think that's right. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And then hopefully deliveries by middle of next year. Right, exactly. Yeah. Well, that's, that's exciting. Prob it's probably going to arrive sooner than my AMG One, oh, really? which I put a deposit five years ago. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, hopefully, yeah. <laughs> Hoping that it will. Yeah. Definitely. The whites you have here. 11 there. There. Now all these will be available for the Valkyrie Spider too, right? So, yeah. So obviously, an Aston can, Martin family. Those so. are some current colors, some colors that we've done in the past. Uh, yep. If there's one that you don't, that you like, that uh, maybe isn't up there, you can go through our Q department, which is our bespoke customization department, which we did for the Newport Beach beach pastel collection mm. which you might recognize vibrant oh, yeah. coral on the, be driving. the dbx that you guys will be driving mm -hmm. so you can get as bespoke and creative as you want yeah paint to sample basically any exactly color. yeah Very nice. well, you guys have a huge variation of white you have any that stands out to you like right now Mm, yeah, that pink one over there. Like, <laughs> I hate to say, but you know, yellow may be pretty cool too with the Aston Martin Valkyrie. You've been really liking yellow recently, huh? Yeah, you know? <laughs> Ever since I got my Bijan jacket. <laughs> yeah, I wonder what they call it. So, this is called Santa Cruz yellow. So how many horses on this one? Because, you know, I don't want my nanny to ring up. 542. No. Yeah, it's a four That's liter twin turbo V8. Yeah. Holy moly, I wasn't expecting that for an SUV. The, the biggest takeaway about the, the DBX, in my opinion, is we built the chassis from the ground up. So it doesn't share a chassis right. or a platform with anyone, uh, any other maker model on the road. So yeah. it rips and drives and handles like a sports car, but you can sit five adults in comfortably. So wow. yeah. well, let's go check it out. Awesome. Look at that. 540 horsepower, did you say? 542. 542. Correct. Wow. You would not really, wow, I love the interior. So we went through Q and made a wow. Newport Beach pastel collection. So this is a one-off color. Wow. Uh, we built it ourselves, and then we matched the interior trim yeah. and lay to yeah, I see the that. exterior paint as well. Uh, yeah, see? Easily put two car seats there. 
Well, hold on to my hat. You got it. <laughs> I'll take this. I'll give you the key. You might uh, need this. Oh, yes. Great success. <laughs> Come on in, Nate. I like the design. It's got a really nice flow to it, you know? And yeah, I would definitely wrap these because this is where you're going to scratch with your watch and yeah. jewelry. Yeah. Beautiful. Well, see you later, my friend. Enjoy. Yeah, yeah I'll see, see you, you tomorrow. tomorrow. All see right. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Very compact. Oh, dude, it feels really comfortable. Right? Yeah. And the seats feel so good. Yeah, there's no excuse for your nanny to be late to anything with this car. I know, but <laughs> this is so nice. Maybe I should drive it and, I don't know, pink? Uh, no. <laughs> Check this out. So, Esports, individual, see? It's white. You got GT, and they got Terrain, Train Plus, if you're going up, you know, Mount Everest. <laughs> There we go. The Sport Plus. Very cool, eh? I like how they put the start button here. Park, reverse, neutral, drive. It's a little too far for me to reach. <laughs> All right, you ready to go? Drive. It's time to warm up those tires. <laughs> so obviously this is out to compete with the Lamborghini Urus. And 542 horsepower. Wow, I wonder how much Urus packs under the hood. Hmm. Well, Urus, what else? The Bentley Bentayga? Yeah. What else is there? Yeah, but Be Bentley is so heavy. True. I mean, I, I think this is very comparable to um, Urus, but let's find out. Wow. Not bad for cold tires. <laughs> All right. Oh my god, you hear those pops? Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Sounds like a Lambo. <laughs> so smooth, but very quick. Got 1,400 mile on the clock. That means I get 14% uh, discount. <laughs> That's how it works. <laughs> <laughs> so it doesn't have a retract. It has to have a retractable roof, right? Oh, it does. Look at oh, no, it doesn't. That's a very large piece to be retractable, right? Yeah, just I think it's just yeah. a moonroof. You know what? Um, it's very firm, mm. like a sports car. Yeah. It's not cushiony like a Mercedes. Mm. But I don't think my nanny or kid's gonna care. <laughs> All they care about is the color and if it looks cool. Yeah, the color and works. This right? is super cool. <laughs> it just may be a little too much horsepower for a nanny car. <laughs> quick right yeah look I'm passing by this other SUV <laughs> wow this thing sounds like a sports car wow and brakes like a damn coat how the hell like oh very nice the steering wheel is very stiff mm. you feel in control How's this compared to the Urus? Because you drove the Urus not too long ago in another video. Yeah, um, I'm gonna be honest. The Urus definitely felt faster mm -hmm. than this car. Um, but wow, look at this sound. more refined in okay. terms of the design and the interior. Right. Urus is very rugged, it's got a lot of buttons. This is more refined um, and definitely a smoother suspension. This is so much a smoother. This is like an Escalade, European Escalade. Maybe not that, much better. Wow. This thing, punch. Does it even feel like you're driving an SUV? Can you feel the weight? No. No, honestly, no, it feels pretty light. Um, but, you know, you're high up there, so you, it does have that feel because mm -hmm. of the height. Yeah. But other than that, it's pretty light, nimble, cool design. It's just definitely too fast for my nanny. Overall score for this car, I would give it an eight and a half. Mm -hmm. And, you know, the 
it is a little tight, compact for a family car, but uh, otherwise it's pretty cool. Amazing. Even these door handles are very nice. Yeah. Oh, let's see how many diapers I could put back there. <laughs> oh, a lot of diapers. <laughs> Dude, this thing punches. It's fun, Woo! huh? And it sounds amazing. Yes, it's all real sound. When you're shifting up. Oh. Yeah. Amazing. Good brakes. Overall, I give it an eight and a half, maybe nine. Okay. Yeah, I like nice. it. Uh, yeah, it's a lot of compact, but hey, that's mm -hmm. so is Urus and yeah. other SUVs that are out. But uh, yeah, so what do they go for? Start at 180. 180? Yeah. Most That's about definitely over my 90s budget. <laughs> <laughs> this is uh, definitely something you don't see on the road. Correct. Very limited. Yep. Yeah. Thank you so much. My pleasure. Here is the key. Thank you. I hope I don't owe you 180 grand. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Very cool. No, I'll definitely show it to my wife. Yeah. And see what she thinks. But I think it's too fast for my nanny. No problem at all. Price aside, you know, that yeah. it's too fast of a car. I'm going to get. My insurance is going to triple. Yeah, <laughs> I understand that. But I appreciate it. Of Thank course. you so much. Anytime I have your yeah. hat inside, let me grab that hat. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. I'm not sure this is going to be a fit for my nanny. But thanks for watching. This was fun. And make sure you subscribe, like the video, and comment down below. What cars should I get uh, from Mercedes to any brand for a replacement car for my nanny? And be safe we will see you guys next week so i sold this for 40.7 million uh two years ago so i made about close to 12 million dollars residential investors work longer hours for lower returns compared to commercial real estate investors contrarian academy helps residential investors successfully acquire their first commercial property in six months or less so there's a lot of pockets of opportunity where you can take great real estate that's located in great location and repurpose it while one state for example houston that's heavily invested in oil and gas industry is experiencing a recession you may have another state like California experiencing the economic boom. You don't really have to wait for a global economic recession to jump out and invest your money and buy real estate. Apply now by clicking the link below.